what makes Journey different is that it is much more of a family feel. It's not walking in as a number and being um, one of the masses. We base a lot of our views on how to run our church on Acts 2, 42 through 47. People meeting in homes and worshiping together, eating together, praying together, living together, doing life together. Relationship and education instead of just a place to go to be entertained. When you go to other churches, you just show up and you have to figure out what category you're in. Here, there is no category. We don't shy away from kind of the difficult issues. Everybody's kind of like a family. We just do things together. What would a family do? How would a family attack this? Or how would a family deal with this? Things that are, um, other churches might kind of shy away from because they're a little hard to understand or they're hard to hear. Um, we don't shy away from that. We work through it as a group, as a family. You come in and you're Vanessa. You come in and you're Callie. You come in and you are just you. The reason I felt God was calling me to start Journey Fellowship is because there is a significant need for different types of churches, not just one type of church, just like there's a significant need for different types of entertainment, different types of music, different types of books. Uh, good snacks and some music. And I was like, all right, I'm down for that, you know? God definitely put Journey Fellowship in my line of sight or even brought me here. You know, people wait for a road sign. It just like, God's like, boop, just like that. I was personally asked by Pastor Carl if I wanted to be part of something new and different. And I was immediately on board. Super Saturday, chili feed, potlucks, all I, I love all that stuff. Our potlucks or our chili feeds. All music Saturdays. This past fall where we got to ride motorcycles in Minneapolis and Wisconsin. Billy's backyard and we had the band and we had food. We had a big outdoor party at Billy's and we had the band music in Billy's backyard. That actually was my first pre-Saturday experience. The first time I came to Journey Fellowship, I was asked to make like molds of people out of Play-Doh and one of the people had to be giving a thumbs up and that's actually one of my favorite sermons. I will never forget the first time I came to Journey because I sat outside the house and I was like, oh my gosh, I can't just walk up to someone's door. I've never met, like I've met these people, but not really in any personal connection kind of way. I sat outside and debated for a few minutes if I was actually gonna go in or not. And thankfully that was the only day that I had to do that was the first time. We see each other as family. In fact, there's a word, fang. Family has a bond. If you're a member of a family, you can't unbecome a member of a family. You're my daughter. You're never going to not be my daughter. And there's also the bond that a gang member has. When you become a gang member, everybody in that gang protects you no matter what, 24-7. They got your back. They don't need to know the details. They got your back. Journey Fellowship is a fang. We have the relationship of a family and the relationship of a gang. Every Saturday I pray that, that uh, there are more people that find that relationship, that life-changing relationship, that realization that God loves them regardless. I kind of was just feeling stagnant in a big church and it was the small family environment in the close fellowship. That's why Journey Fellowship is named what it is. I was looking for a deeper connection. I felt like my faith was being more superficial. A lot more opportunity for growth than with a large church in your someone instead of just someone, something in a seat. We're not a number here, we're people. It's real connection. It's not just the, the oh, how's it going fine typical answer. Like you can truly be where you're at. A friend invited me and then after that, I just felt this pull to keep coming. I kept learning more and more about God. Our friendship just kept growing and growing, and growing together towards God too. I got connected through my good friend Callie, who was like, hey, you want to go to church one morning? And I was like, sure. She's like, it's on a Saturday. It's like, perfect. I'm down. I just hope to grow closer in a relationship to God. I've filled a lot of notebooks and a lot of journals since I started coming to Journey. The family here, the community. Love this church. Just the sincerity, the family, the love. Good snacks. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Do I need to do it's air beautiful. quotes?